The truth about the Apple TV 2025 is finally coming into focus, and it's not what anyone expected. For years, the Apple TV has been that small, simple black box sitting under the television, premium, reliable, but rarely exciting. It quietly did its job, streaming movies and shows in perfect quality, with Apple's trademark polish. But this time, everything is changing. Apple isn't just preparing an upgrade. They're preparing a shift that could redefine how we experience entertainment at home. This new Apple TV isn't just a device anymore. It's an anchor, the centerpiece of something far larger. Think of it not as another gadget, but as the foundation of Apple's next major ecosystem play. For a company known for turning everyday products into revolutionary platforms, that's a big statement. The 2025 Apple TV could be the first true step toward merging entertainment, gaming, and smart home control into one unified system. For years, the Apple TV has lived in the shadow of the iPhone, iPad, and Mac. It was always there, sleek, powerful, and expensive, but never quite the star of the show. That's about to change. The leaks, patents, and insider reports surrounding the 2025 model reveal a product that's been completely reimagined. This isn't just another box for Netflix. It's Apple's bold attempt to take over your living room, and maybe even your entire home. At the heart of this transformation lies power, and not just a small upgrade in performance. The new Apple TV is rumored to leap straight to the A17 Pro chip, the same silicon that powers the iPhone 15 Pro. That's an enormous leap from the A15 Bionic used in the current model. The A17 Pro isn't just fast, it's a monster of efficiency, designed to handle console-level graphics, real-time AI computation, and demanding workloads that most streaming boxes could never dream of managing. The question is, why would Apple put such a powerful chip inside a streaming box? The answer points to something far bigger than streaming. Apple is quietly laying the groundwork to turn the Apple TV into a legitimate gaming console, one capable of competing with the likes of Sony's PlayStation and Microsoft's Xbox. Let that sink in. Apple is positioning its little black box as a serious gaming device. This isn't just about Apple Arcade's mobile-style titles anymore. With the A17 Pro's hardware-accelerated ray tracing and neural engine, Apple can bring high-end gaming experiences right into your living room, without the need for a massive console tower or noisy fans. Imagine playing visually demanding titles like Resident Evil 4 Remake or Death Stranding not on a PlayStation, but directly through your Apple TV, either streamed or running natively. That's a radical shift. For years, Apple was seen as the outsider in gaming. Their hardware was powerful, but their ecosystem wasn't built for serious gamers. Now, the landscape is changing. Apple's move toward console-level performance signals that they're ready to play in that arena. The A17 Pro can handle advanced lighting, shadows, reflections, and high frame rates, things gamers crave. Combined with Apple's growing focus on Apple Arcade and its partnerships with major game studios, this could mark the start of Apple's next big gaming era. But that's not the only reason for the A17 Pro. The chip's neural engine unlocks something even more transformative, intelligence. The kind of intelligence that turns your TV from a passive screen into an active, thinking companion. Apple calls it Apple Intelligence, a more advanced, personalized, and context-aware evolution of Siri. And the Apple TV 2025 might be its most ambitious showcase yet. Imagine this, you walk into your living room, sit down, and say, Siri, play a sci-fi movie from Apple TV Plus that's under two hours and has won an Oscar. Instantly, the Apple TV doesn't just search, it understands. It considers your preferences, your watch history, even the time of day. It doesn't just recommend something random. It curates something meaningful. That's the promise of Apple intelligence. Unlike cloud-based assistants that rely on distant servers, Apple's AI will process most tasks locally using the A17 Pro's advanced neural engine. That means faster responses, better privacy, and truly adaptive behavior. The more you use it, the smarter it becomes. It learns what kind of shows you watch on weekends, what you prefer at night, and even how your mood changes over time. This isn't TH. E Siri you're used to, this is a system that understands you on a deeper level. And Apple might not stop there. Multiple leaks suggest that the new Apple TV could include a built-in camera, something no previous model has had. 
Now, before anyone panics about privacy, this isn't about surveillance, it's about interaction. A built-in camera would unlock FaceTime on the big screen, letting you chat with friends and family in full HD, right from your couch. But even more intriguing are the possibilities beyond video calls. Gesture controls. Face recognition. Presence detection. These are the features that could turn your television into an intuitive control center. Imagine waving your hand to pause a movie, or simply looking at the TV to resume playback. Imagine the Apple TV recognizing who's in the room and automatically switching to that person's profile and recommendations. Apple has the software expertise and the ecosystem to make that kind of seamless experience possible. It's futuristic, but it's also completely within reach. And if you think that's impressive, wait until you hear about connectivity. One of the biggest upgrades expected for the 2025 Apple TV is Wi-Fi 7 support. On paper, that might sound like a small technical jump. But in practice, it's a game-changer. Wi-Fi 7 delivers ultra-low latency, higher throughput, and more stable connections than any previous generation. For gaming, this means smoother online play with virtually zero lag. For streaming, it means instant loading of 8K HDR content without buffering or drops in quality. But Apple's push for Wi-Fi 7 isn't just about speed, it's about integration. This new networking standard makes the Apple TV a perfect hub for the matter and thread smart home ecosystem. That means your Apple TV won't just stream shows. It'll quietly manage your entire home, controlling lights, thermostats, cameras, and locks with unmatched stability and speed. In Apple's vision, your Apple TV isn't just another device. It's the brain of your smart home. It's the hub that keeps everything connected, responding instantly to commands and automations. If you tell Siri to dim the lights and start a movie, the Apple TV could handle all of that simultaneously. No delays. No lag. Just pure synchronization between entertainment and automation. And that's what makes this device so strategic. It's not just a media player. It's Apple's Trojan horse, the gateway that brings Apple's intelligence, gaming ambitions, and smart home control to the biggest screen in your house. And Apple wants it everywhere. That's why one of the most shocking rumors surrounding this device isn't about power or features, it's about price. Traditionally, Apple TV models have been expensive, often costing far more than competitors like Roku, Fire TV, or Chromecast. But according to reliable analysts, Apple might be preparing to flip that script entirely. Reports suggest that the new model could launch with a starting price under $100. That's unprecedented. A device with console-level power, Wi-Fi 7, and AI-driven intelligence priced to compete directly with budget streamers? It sounds impossible, but it makes perfect sense when you consider Apple's strategy. Apple no longer relies solely on hardware profits. Its long-term growth is driven by services Apple TV+, Apple Arcade, Apple Music, Fitness+, Plus, and more. The Apple TV 2025 isn't about selling hardware. It's about selling access, a gateway to Apple's ecosystem of paid experiences. Once you buy an Apple TV, you're not just a customer, you're part of the ecosystem. You start using Apple Arcade, you subscribe to Apple TV+, maybe you sync your HomePods and iPhone, and suddenly, your entire digital life revolves around Apple. That's why an affordable, high-powered Apple TV makes so much sense. It's the entry point. The first taste that hooks users for years. And that's why the 2025 model could be the most important Apple TV ever made. It's no longer just a streaming box. It's a multifunctional command center, one that combines entertainment, intelligence, gaming, and smart home automation, all tied together by Apple's software and services. This isn't about dominating a niche. It's about owning the living room. So when you look at the leaks, the A17 Pro chip, the built-in AI, the Wi-Fi 7 connectivity, the possible camera, and the surprisingly low price, it's clear that Apple isn't just updating the Apple TV. They're redefining what a home D device can be. This small black box could quietly become the most important product Apple releases in years. Think about it, in a world where every screen, every light, every speaker, and every lock can talk to each other, the device that sits at the center of that network has incredible power. Apple wants that power. 
and with the Apple TV 2025, they might just get it.